I'm just like the worst friend ever. I'm running off of fuel. If I'm gonna cheat, I might as well like go out. Tina's going back to Georgia. Sit! He hit his head yesterday, you see that? Cooking in the kitchen, that's what I do. I have been watching her videos for like the past two hours. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl here, Large Wait, that sounded really weird. Anyway guys, I am in the car driving. I'm gonna insert the scripture of the day now. My cousin Sheena, as you guys saw in the last vlog, she's in town and she's leaving to go back to Georgia. Georgia! Georgia! Tomorrow. So, I'm so glad that I am actually about to spend some time with her because since that girl moved to Georgia, she has only hung out with your girl twice. And we used to be best friends! You know, but keeping a long distance friendship is really difficult, especially for me because even my friends who live in the area, like I'm just like the worst friend ever because I'm just too busy for my own good. I don't have the time to maintain friendships. Like I just have so much going on in my life that, you know, I I just, I'm, I'm really bad at it. And it's something that I wish weren't true, but it is. But anyway, so we're gonna hang out tonight at Cold Stone Creamery. But the thing is, I am still on my diet, so no ice cream for large a unless they have vegan ice cream but even if they have vegan ice cream i probably won't have any because i'm sure it has a lot of sugar and i'm trying to stay away from dairy and sugar even though for dinner tonight i cooked pasta and ground beef with vegetables and cheese yeah <laughs> i just felt like being a rebel but since i had some dairy today like i'm definitely not gonna have even more oh hey guys man today has been one of those days ah. trying to hang in there as much as I can sorry if I sound stuffy is because I am stuffy uh, the boys have had a cold you know and you know and you're taking care of two sick kids they're probably gonna get it no matter how immune you are to certain things but uh, yeah but today's just been kind of crazy from clients just totally angry and upset with you for no reason it's not your fault nothing you can do about it but you know they're usually nice 99 percent of the time but you know it's an off day and they want to take it out on you what can you do and you know driving to certain places far and then finding out hey you're not allowed to come in today you might have to go back it's just like nice nice and i thought i lost my cell phone for a long time and Jonathan kind of went to sleep really late. He just didn't want to go to sleep. I don't know what happened. So I think I went to sleep at four. I'm running off of fumes. <laughs> oh, guys. The day's almost over. I'm almost there. The good thing is, I'm still alive. And I am going to go home to my wife and to my kids. And no matter what, even if they are going to be difficult today, if, if they are difficult today, I'm still going to be happy. Guys, my GPS took me on the Merritt Parkway and I thought I was lost for a second, but thanks God. I'm okay. I'm a, I'm alive. I made it. Okay, so update and it's not really what I want. The client won't let me go inside. So I got to got to go back to the office. Even though like my house is is like a mile right behind me. A mile right there. But guess what? I'm going to drive 16 miles that way. It's all right, guys. I'll see you later. Hey, guys. What's going on? I'm here. And these girls and Antoine, this Antoine, they're so bad. They made me get something. Like, they made me do it. Huh? It's not like it. <laughs> One, two, three, she said I smell like I took a bath. I did, okay? Yeah, so I got the cotton candy, which is like the worst one here, but I figured if, it, if I'm gonna cheat, I might as well like go all out. So, yeah. What is it again? Cookies and cream? No. It's um, cake. 
cake batter. Oh, okay. She but says it's it's too too Well, I mean, I haven't even tasted mine yet. This is mine here. But yeah, guys, I feel really bad. I was doing so good on my diet, and I guess this is just my cheat day, you know? Stop eating. It's okay. Come on, guys, let's gather in. Let's gather in here. Sheena. <laughs> Sheena's going back to Georgia. Oh, Georgia. You know that song? I sing it all the time when people say Georgia. And they that's get, so, that's they the get only up. Georgia <laughs> reference I know. <laughs> so annoying Sheena's going back to Georgia with her boo thang. Woo! Hey, really? <laughs> <laughs> guys, it's freezing cold. I don't want to go home. Cabrina's already in the car. Like, I gotta <laughs> Nicole, I don't know where she's going. Oh. But yeah, guys, um, we're leaving and Sheena wants to say something to you. Hey, you guys. <laughs> I'm so cute though. Hey, Bye. <laughs> Alright guys, so um yeah, this is awkward. I don't know what to say, but we're gonna leave. Okay, bye. Bye <laughs> guys, I am on my way home. Oh my goodness. It's a shame that Rudy couldn't have been here because we had a good time. It was really fun, but gotta take care of the kids and all that stuff, so Ah, Antoine treated us to the ice cream, so I didn't get a chance to buy something for Rudy. So he's probably not gonna be happy about that. Yeah, I kind of wanted to do like a karaoke in the car on my way home, but I don't think they're playing any good music right now, and that kind of sucks. But yeah, <coughs> sing in the arms of the angel. Jonathan, get to asses. What are you doing? You're trying to be like your brother was a year ago? Jonathan, oh my goodness. Jaden, tell your brother to stop. Dile que no. Okay, you paying attention? Where are you going? What is your obsession with toes, Jonathan? He hit his head yesterday, you see that? Looks terrible. Do you okay? Yeah. Guys, I have no idea what the last thing was that I said to you, but it's a lot later in the day. We all napped. Oh, Jonathan, I hate to see that thing on your forehead. I'm so sorry you fell there. I hate seeing it. Oh, gosh, he's at the age where he just, like, hurts himself a lot. Jaden went through that phase a little bit. I'm glad that it's kind of over now. It's over now. But yeah, so Rudy's home and we're going to cook dinner. We're cooking fish and something like that. So I'm going to go downstairs now because I am hungry. Kind of, a little bit. I had a smoothie for my snack. I had a smoothie and an apple for a snack. And before that I had two rice cakes and some nuts. So yeah, we're going to go downstairs. I think Jonathan wants to sleep. I'm not sure. But yeah. Yo, 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 I'm chilling, cooking in the kitchen. That's what I do. That's who I am. I'm not a kitchen. I was gonna say that's who I am. I'm not a kitchen. But I'm here, I'm cooking a crispy milk catfish. Larry is putting Jonathan to sleep. Those are some cousins in the background. They're making a little bit of noise, but let them be happy. Today for me was, it was better than yesterday, but tomorrow might not be as good. I'll let you guys know. But still, I'm keeping the smile. I'm gonna keep that smile, all right? I'll see. Mmm, yumma. Hey guys, what's going on? I see your large A here, ready to close the vlog. Good I know that it was pretty short, wasn't it? Yeah, it was like only eight minutes. But I'm here to entertain you for the rest of the time. So, I'm gonna read the question of the day and the comment of the day. I will not be singing tonight because I just, I don't know. It's funny because in the last vlog I said, oh, I'm never not in the mood to sing. <laughs> but guess what? I ain't in the mood to sing tonight. So I hope that's okay with you. <laughs> I don't know. I've just been sitting out there. I didn't vlog today, so I feel like I can talk. But I've just been sitting in the bed 
watching videos where you, you guys know Patricia Bright I think that's her name she just like spends a whole bunch of money on these websites and just to see if like they're legit and then she films herself trying on everything like $500 worth of stuff $1,100 worth of stuff and I have been watching her videos for like the past two hours and just working on a sweater for myself like that has been my life so it's just it's just interesting that I've just been doing that and now I'm gonna close out the vlog but I think I'm going to spend the rest of the night with Mr. Rooney but watching Netflix Hulu whatever and just hanging out being a family so well not being a family obviously because the boys are sleeping dull RJ hey you shut your mouth all right so the question of the day comes from Keisha Bell she says are you the oldest or Larique this is one of the most frequently asked questions besides when are you gonna move out Larique is older than I am I'm not gonna tell you by how many years you guys can dig and do all the research you want to figure it out how old she is but yeah a lot of people ask this even in person someone asked yesterday during the christening she said oh who's older you or Larique I said guess and she said you I was like no <laughs> I act older Larique is um Larique is shy and she keeps to herself and she's quiet she has a really soft voice and I, I guess that makes her seem younger than I do because I'm I'm the opposite well not completely like I'm shy too believe it or not yeah but I'm not soft-spoken like she is if that makes sense so I guess that's why people think that she's younger but no she's older for sure and the comment of the day comes from Jarrett Banks, that's my homie. He said, you're a beautiful woman no matter what, love the video. Oh Jarrett, he's just so sweet. Like, okay, so if you guys follow me on Twitter, which you should be doing, I rant a lot. Like whenever I'm in a bad mood, I open Twitter and I just release all my thoughts and feelings because sometimes I don't feel like laying my burdens on Rudy's shoulders. Lay down your burdens. Lay down your shame. Is that how the song goes? All who are broken, lift up your name. I thought you didn't feel like singing, Larj. Shut your mouth. Yeah, so I don't even know what I was saying. Oh yeah, Jared, he's so sweet. He watches all the live videos and then when I rant on Twitter or sometimes like on the other account, like he'll comment back and I really appreciate that. We need more Jareds in the world. Someone who can be encouraging and uplifting and reassure you that you know what, boo? You cute. <laughs> like I really like that. So thank you so much. Guys, I'm gonna go now. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Make sure that you're subscribed to us. If you're not, follow us on social media. You can find all the links to that in the description of this video. Get some sleep larger. You should do that. And I'll talk to you next time. Okay, bye. Are raising a family. This is how life should be. This is their story